Okay, so that street right down there is called the Rue dos Invernarios, Street of the Herbalists. So we're just gonna walk down that way and kind of check it out. And you can also see this kind of black and white tile um, floor all the way down. It goes, keeps going down that way, but that's a different street. But we're gonna be walking down that street right there. Uh, street of the Herbalists, Rue dos Invernarios. Hey, check it out, Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Okay, so that's gonna be our target street right back there. But I just kind of want to go down slightly to the end because we got a lot of other interesting stuff too. Here's Airlight Cafe. It's kind of interesting. And then we got some nice artwork right here as well. And there's a lot of artwork all the way down in the street. And uh, before we go down, there's also antiques as well. So we got some antique shops like that one. Kind of going a little bit closer to the detail. It's kind of cool. Okay, so we're gonna keep on walking down a little bit further. And we also got some more um, coffee shops and artwork. Let's go down to the artwork. There, I guess I guess that was the artwork I was thinking of. So if we keep on going all the way down, we'd um, we're on Huiday to uh, to to Sano. So we'll just walk down briefly, just to this corner, and then we're going to um, kind of highlight this whole spot and come back down. Little alleys everywhere. I don't know if I've filmed that one. I'm in Sano Venio. So we're gonna walk down our Target Street here. And we're kind of on Tersena right now, Hua de Tersena, Tersena Street. And then we're gonna walk down Invernarios as well. We got some little alleys. I don't know if I've been down that alley before either. Um, you might end up going down some of these. I, I think I have. Actually, that alley has a lot of different artwork in it. So yeah, this one, I'll just go down it briefly just because um, um, actually this whole area has a lot of artwork and what I liked about this one in particular is there's these little patios like Patio de Sao Paulo and there's another one up here another one here, Patio de Vaz I have filmed in here before but, um, but yeah, actually we're getting a little bit but actually this is better because this way you get the full context of Invernario there's also seems to be like kind of a little famous cafe right there. Let me just kind of see what this one is. So 1958 is this one right here. Let's go back this way. So they have these kind of older shops as well. So I think that one is um, definitely worth, worth exploring as well. Like a soybean delicatessen. So we're going to keep on walking down this way and kind of exploring. And then we're going to get um, quite a bit of uh, artwork as well. And we might even stop by my friend Pedro's place. We just kind of highlight some of this coffee shop right there. Alleys. Okay. Yeah, actually, it's really crowded today. It's also, um, it's a holiday right now. It's Good Friday, and uh, since there's a little beko right there. And since it's a holiday, um, Macau has a lot of holidays. Mostly because it's, um, it's kind of cool. Mostly because it's uh, Portuguese originally. More of these little, um, there's a little temple right there. Right here. Yeah, actually, if you remember, my other friend is he was really interested in this spot, and they got a little temple right there. And actually, there's some interesting stuff down that way too. But um, but we're gonna stick to our street right now. This is very popular at nighttime. It stays open all night.
okay. I'm gonna keep on going down. Uh, I think they're doing something new here, but they usually had some pretty cool stuff right there. But they've always had this one right here. Then we have all these little traversas, there's tiny small streets. So yeah. Looks like they're doing some repair right here, but in the past they would they actually had um, like a little mini Sao Paulo ruins kind of thing. And over here, they usually play um, games in this area. Like that. Public bathroom down that way. And yeah, I think this is kind of a, um, a lot of community will hang out here, especially at nighttime. In between. It's kind of cool like that. So we're actually going to see if um, Pedro's here. He has a... Um, he owns a food truck. It is right here. Closed. It's not there today. He's doing some some major changes into his cafe, but usually you can sit right here, and um, and that's a really nice place right there called Food Truck. And he's also doing some stuff up there too, so he might be working today. <laughs> Anyways, we'll keep on exploring. There's a hotel to the right. So this one is a new hotel. I don't see the sign, but um, Art of Macau is actually a hotel. Sehudos so Invernarios. Some chairs, dream catchers. So yeah, they're putting a lot of money into this area as well. <laughs> I was actually with the Pedro, the food truck um, owner, and he was showing me some stuff late at night, and I filmed it. And one of the ones he filmed that he showed me was this one, Patio de Mina. I'm going to talk about that later because I'm going to focus on that one. But that one actually supposedly has tunnels to stuff all the ruins. So we'll um, maybe focus on that. So you can watch that later. Um, Porta de Art. So let me just see here. So there's our street, who it does in Vernarios. Then we got these little alleys. Let's see. Actually, all of these are worth exploring. We might focus on this today, this whole area. Give you a bunch of different videos. In the evening, they'll also put um, shopping shops in this middle street, clothing shops, stuff like that. Let's see what this one is. So this one right here is a coffee shop. There's um, several coffee shops. I think this one's called, let me take a look here. Pace. So that one's called Pace. And there's always people doing photography right in here because it's such a cool spot. And we're going to go a little bit further and then we're going to come to the end of the street. They're playing uh, a, a, a mahjong or some kind of 
game. I usually don't film it because I don't know if they're gambling or not. I have no idea. And in here they'll have some restaurants at nighttime. And there's a Triangle Cafe right there. Okay. And we're just gonna come out to the end here. And so yeah, that's our Target Street. Who does in Banarios? And we're kind of coming out to the end. So we'll flip the camera around and then we'll kind of highlight this space. And that was our focus all the way down, all the way down that street right there. Let's just kind of go across real quick. And then if you go up, huh, you got like a little tourist thing right there. Um, I don't see that very often, these ones, they're for uh, tourism. But if you go up there, that's Sunau Square and Sao Paulo Ruins. And our focus is, uh, is that other street. Right there. Okay. So I hope you like that one. Who does in Bernarios? Hey, check it out Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Yeah. Yeah.